Alright, so we just got a huge amount of evidence on this photo here. Well, that's not the, uh, the court record. Uh, five-year-old photo, so there was some murder there. Uh, I think next I should probably go check out where the murder had, uh, that, well, at least that death took place. Not exactly a murder, it was more of an accident. But I remember my friend who would tell me to play this game. Uh, I haven't actually clicked this yet. So I can look through here now and check on uh, profiles, I guess. Me's little sister, currently trained to become a spirit medium. I'll give the prosecutor and a ruthless man who'd do anything to get a guilty verdict. Detective at a lo local precinct, in charge of the initial investigation. The defendant, action star who plays in the title role in the Steel Samurai TV show. A uh, security guard at Global Studios claims she saw a power sending to the scene. The victim, a former big name action star, played the role of the evil magistrate. A big fan of the Steel Samurai, present at the studio on the day of the crime. Uh, Penny Nichols, assistant at Global Studios in charge of the large props and stead pieces. Salmonella, creator of the Steel Samurai, present on the day of the crime. Uh, high ranking producer at Global Studios, present on the day of the crime. Okay, that was some information. Uh, oh wait, actually, I do want to move. Uh, I want to go check out what happened outside of Studio 2. Oh, is there something here? October 19th. Studio 1 entrance. Think back, Nick. To the day of the murder. Mr. Hammer put on the Steel Samurai costume. Then he left from here to go to Studio 2. Right. But why? I wonder if someone called him. Like, the director? Or the producer? Uh... I don't know. Honestly. <laughs> I just want to go examine what happened to the... Yeah, what happened with the murder five years ago? Uh, Studio 2 entrance. Hey, Nick. It's Miss Squeeze. Hello? Uh, hello? H-E-L-L-O. -L -L Maya. You should at least try to be polite. I'm watching the clouds. That's all she had to say, apparently. Worse. Yes, I've been suspicious of this thing for so long, and we finally know. There's some flowers here. Wow, so pretty. They're taking good care of these. Don't get too close to that fence. This looks dangerous. Yeah, it is dangerous. Okay, then I, uh, you know, I'll just talk to you then. Uh, talk. Director, or do I want? No, I'll just talk to her first, and then I'll present the picture if I need to. Mr. Hammer. Um, excuse me? Mr. Hammer came here on the day of the murder, and... Shh. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I'm watching the clouds. I'm not interested in talking to you. Do something, Nick. She's really ticking me off. Oh, dear. Is she not going to talk about anything? Um, I was wondering if you could tell me about Mr. Manella. If you must talk about that man, perhaps you could talk about it in the trailer. By yourselves. Oh. Oh dear. Um, Mr. Powers wasn't the killer. You don't have to cancel the Steel Samurai. I think I'm real tired. I'm tired of the Steel Samurai show. You. You did it. Nick, she did it. She's the killer. <laughs> My fave blood speaks to me. I know it. I know it. Oh dear. Uh, I guess I do it to present the picture. That's, um... Where is it? This? Yeah. Uh, maybe she'll talk about five years ago. She's not even looking. Where? What? Where did you get that? I, well... Old bag. O old? She means the security lady, Miss Oldbag, Nick. Right, anyway. Miss Squeeze, you hid the incident from the press, didn't you? And you used it to control Mr. Hammer. The wind. The huh? It's gotten stronger, don't you think? I think. Your conversation interests me. Let's talk about it more, inside the trailer. Nick, she went inside the trailer. Okay. Let's hope she doesn't have a gun in there or something. Uh, into the trailer, I guess. Hmm, you came. Well, then. 
What was it that you were talking about? Why is she so eager to talk all of a sudden? Mr. Squeeze. You were using that accident. You were blackmailing Mr. Hammer so you could control him, weren't you? That's why he was doing the kid show for petty change. Hmm. So I'm a blackmailer now. Well, that's what it was, wasn't it? I mean, sure, it was an accident. But you used it to drag Mr. Hammer down from his rightful place as a star. Oh? I haven't pulled anyone down from anywhere. Mr. Hammer's career went sour of its own accord. But... You were the cause. You pressured him. And to think it was just an accident. Excuse me. What is this all about? You keep saying accident, accident. How are you so sure? What do you mean? Must I spell everything out for you? Think. What would it be if it wasn't an accident? No. No way. You mean Mr. Hammer did it? On purpose? That is what I mean. Well, where's your proof? Can you prove it? Hmm. Just think. Would he have let me run his life for five years over a mere accident? And I ran him hard, believe you me. But, but the security lady said it was an accident. Oh, well, she was a big fan of hammers, you see. She jumped on the reporter who brought that photo into the studio. She wrenched it out of his hands, she did. Gave him a few bruises, too. So that's why she had the photo. She's an old fool. Of course, all the reporters would need is the negatives. He could have made a copy, but he didn't. The, uh, the only copy of the photo is the one you hold. Give it to me, now. What? This is valuable evidence. Boys? Oh boy. Um, who are they? Professionals. They're good at erasing various things. What do you think? Would you like to be erased? What? The trial ends tomorrow. How unfortunate. It's a shame you'll have to miss it. Tell me why. Why do you want this photograph so badly? This is Mr. Hammer's dirt, no? Why should the Diva Squeeze care about it at all? I'm sure you'll have plenty of time to think about that where you're going. So long, friends. Boys, erase away. No! Oh, was that the end of the game? Oh! Oh boy. Hold it right there. I heard everything, pal. Diva Squeeze. You coming down to the precinct with me. Now. Hmm. Not bad. Very well. It appears this contest will be decided tomorrow then. In court. I'll be looking forward to it. G Gumshoe, you actually did something. I'm so proud of you. You did something that wasn't completely idiotic or wrong or accusing the wrong person. I'm so proud of you. Hey, you okay, pal? Sorry, I was a little late with my entrance. I don't get many chances to practice that sort of thing. Detective Gumshoe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I was really scared. Huh? Don't mention it, pal. I'm just doing my job. Detective Gumshoe. Sorry, it's just... I want to say that line ever since I became a detective. Well, okay. I've got one more job to do today. I'm sure we'll run into each other soon again soon. Gumshoe away! Well, Link, it looks like we're getting close to the bottom of this. And who's at the bottom? Deep squeeze. To be continued. Uh, save. Well, I was not expecting that to end so soon. That was not a very long like, uh, investigation period. Usually the last, like, I'll just stop this one here before, uh, I go on to the trial then. I'm thinking this is the final trial. October 20th, 10am, District Court, Court number 4.